The Chicago Police Department is holding entry exams all over the city today, but union members may be there to greet them with a warning. Eric Wrong is live at Harold Washington College with more. Good morning, Eric. Good morning to you. Sources telling WGN that the FOP is offering $500 to members who will stand outside city colleges where those entrance exams are being given all day long here to tell potential applicants that City Hall does not have their backs. This, of course, really just an extension of the fight between the FOP and the city over the vaccine mandate. Now, the Fraternal Order of Police says that 23 officers are in no pay status for failing to report their vaccination status to the city. The police department says that number is 21. The superintendent expects the percentage of officers compliance to grow from the high 60s to 80 percent by the weekend. The union is telling its officers to hold the line. It says the city needs to take the mandate into collective bargaining. This all coming at a time when the department is losing a lot of officers. WGN investigates found that Chicago is on pace to lose a thousand officers this year to resignation and retirement and it's having a hard time recruiting people to replace those officers and this is all before the vaccine mandate really began to accelerate that's the highest annual total of officers leaving the department since at least 2018 the fop and the city will be back in court today as well the fop is asking a judge to suspend the city's vaccination policy while the city wants to extend its restraining order on the fop president's use of social media to discourage officers from complying with the vaccine mandate now the FOP is also asking officers to donate $100 to those officers that are in that no pay status. The morning session for the entrance exams this morning starts at 8 o'clock, or actually the doors open at 8. The test starts at 8.30. We're live downtown. I'm Eric Rock, WGN News.